Why did you do that? What? Well, why did you paint your prosthetic leg black? It's depressing. No, it's not. Yes, it is. Oh, and I was hoping you're cured. I am cured. Your leg was sick, remember? That's why I had to cut it off. I know you loved it, but sometimes we have to let go of the things we love the most. Hmm? How's the other leg? She's fine. A bit sad, maybe. Her sister was amputated. They were twins. Mm, I see. So maybe they should be together. Yeah, all right, I'll think about it.
Did you enjoy the fresh air, Mr. Black? I'm surprised you didn't try to jump the wall and escape. <laughs> I want to get to the bottom of this as much as you do. If that were true, that would surprise me. Like I said, Mr. Black, all actions have consequences. You set a lunatic on the loose and just look what happened. Poor Mr. Keating died because of your decisions. Maybe I'll make 
need to fix this. I will not accept what happened to my daughter. Nor will I live with a wife who holds me responsible. I will find whoever did this. So Lenore will see the truth. So she will forgive me. And so things can go back to the way they were before all this. in biometric database. DNA found. One matching profile. Lenore Ramsey.
to get me out of here, mate. They started talking behind my back. I can hear them. I think they know. Fuck, if that's true, I'm done. Get me a transfer to a different prison or, or bail me out or... I don't know, you're the fucking counsellor, aren't you? If I don't get out, I'm dead. Changed her four times in the last three hours. She will not stop. Please, can you take her? I need to lie down for a moment. Well, sure, but I thought we agreed to do this together. I just need to lie down. Hi, Mum. Lenore and I were wondering if you wanted... What? It's me. Your son. Calm down, Mum. It's fine. Everything's fine. Yes, that's right. Are you okay? Right. Um, no, no. No, it's fine. It's fine. So, Lenore and I were wondering... Anyone who says they slept like a baby clearly never had one. Oh, look, she's trying to talk to you. Adult brains, I understand. But this, this is just incessant, incoherent garbling. What on earth is she doing?
So the doctor said that Mum can't distinguish between the past and the present. It's all jumbled together somehow. How can a person forget so much? Why can't they help her remember? Give for one second alone with my thoughts. One goddamn second. One moment she wanted to know why I wasn't in school. The next she was crying and complaining about her son, who never comes to visit. You were there every day. Whether she remembered or not, you were there for her. How can a person just forget? I should have helped her remember somehow. I should have found a way. You did everything you could. She loved you very much. Remember that at least. Mom. Why is Daddy so sad? He's worried about your gran, my love. He's just worried, that's all. I really don't see why you hired this one. She doesn't ever seem to know where you are. She won't put you on the phone. She's a good assistant, Lenore. Huge potential. Give her time. I'm sure you'll warm to her. Just keep an eye on her, will you? I don't trust her. Grace said you promised to help with her science homework. Oh, shit. I'm, I'm just... C can you help her tonight? Do you mind? Fine. I've got this presentation first thing in the morning. I really feel like I'm on the verge of something here. This would mean so much for us, for the family. You understand, don't you? <laughs> my love. Maybe we should ask Rose Atkins when he'll be home. Maybe she'll even set up an appointment for us. You don't like her. I don't trust her. You don't trust her? Or you don't trust Dad? Robert, listen. I don't care. You have Grace, and because of that, you have Lenore. But you also have me. And I'm not going anywhere. It won't be long before Grace is old enough to leave home. Until then, there's you and me and the work. For now, that's all that matters. I love you. Who those memories belong to is entirely irrelevant. They do not contain the answers we're looking for. Trust me. Now is not the time to start thinking, Black. Nobody cares about whatever theories you may have dreamed up in that little brain of yours. Now is the time to do as I say. Now is the time to proceed. Fuck you. 